I said earlier, I'd probably play some mobile games on the stream later. Uh, and that's what I'm doing right now. However, I do want to talk a little bit about, uh, before I go to Opera Omni, because uh, Opera Omni did get some new content. I want to talk a little Oh, what the fuck? I have to turn off my Xbox there. I'm going to talk a little bit about King of Fighters here for a minute, because earlier today on the stream, uh, Valerie, or Azura and Valerie, were asking uh, how you do Awakening in this game. Now, Awakening is a really kind of bullshit. It's fucking bullshit. But, uh, it, you know, I, I figure since I have the, I have probably a couple of fucking people I can awaken, I can just take care of right now and demonstrate how it works. So, hopefully I don't have to actually fucking do any pulls. But, so the way it would work would be like this. And I'm talking about this from the perspective of, like, them watching us right now. So, I'm taking care of this first. So, first things first, you're going to want to check and see if you have fighter memory. As you see right here, I have... Memory for several different characters. I'm trying to think if any of these characters are not awakened as of right now. I think Hydra's not awakened. Let's see if we can't awaken him real fast. Actually, what about the Fest characters? These have one. Okay. Yeah, no, all the Fest characters are awakened. Okay, so let's go down here and let's find. I think I saw. Yeah, I saw you there. Can I have fully max you out right now or no? I can evolve you, but do I have enough to land break you all the way? I do not. I'm missing a couple. Uh, I need a character who I fucking have the actual soul for. And I can just land break like that. Okay, wait, Hydrant. Is Hydrant already max? Hydrant's level 90, so is he already awakened? He's not awakened. Alright, perfect. Uh, so as you can see here, we have a fully maxed out Hydrant, level 90, all that good jazz. And we do have one of his souls. So you come down here, you, again, you have to have him maxed out at level 90. You have to have him fully maxed out. I don't know if the star, I don't know if you have to fucking have him, uh, I don't know if you have to have his, uh, star level fully maxed out. I think you do, because I, here, let me, uh, let me check, um, back to her real quickly. Yeah, okay, yeah, so you do have to have, you do have to have him six starred, no big deal. Uh, yeah, so you six star them, then you get the awakening thing. Alright, and then you just go over here. Uh, you just hit the awaken. You just take the one soul you have. Now you can only get this in, you know, gotcha mode or in the gotcha, and boom, there you go. Uh, full, fully awakened hydrant. Uh, unfortunately, while you can use generic soul to level them up further beyond. Uh, you still need one of their own souls. So Vanessa is my highest character right now. Uh, unfortunately, maxing the characters out is also kind of bullshit because you need specific fucking XP. But this specific XP only works for the specific area. So as you can see right here, I have 20 and 3. And I have fucking 8 and 1. But it's not letting me use either of them. And it's only letting me fucking use what's in 20. Or what's in the 2 spot. Which is super fucking annoying. Uh, but yeah, no, so that's how the awakening system works. Uh, we might come back to this game later on in the stream or not because I do have to still get done my challenges here to guarantee me a fest character. Um, yeah, the Gintama event's finally coming to an end. I can't say I'm disappointed. Honestly, I, I did not find this event very, very enjoyable. It's just, uh, oh cool, we got 80 gems. I oh, clicked the wrong one. Like, maybe if I was a Gintama fan, I'd probably enjoy it better, but, uh, as, as it stands, this was kind of just like a boring event. I don't even. I think I did maybe one multi. I don't even think I did a multi pulls time around actually. I think I just kind of fucking ignored it. Oh, cool. So that means we got a. Uh, we got I think like thirty five. This is a free fest character they gave for the event. So like, while I don't like the event itself, and I would have preferred like rather not having the event, it was pretty cool. That they just gave us a straight free fest character. As you can see right there, uh, the character soul is on uh, is on the roulette banner. Uh, I don't think I pulled their soul at any point. No, wait, hang on. I'm in the wrong chat. There we go. I'll say, wait, hang on. What the fuck did someone join? I just got, I just got like, sort of waste my tickets right now because... Uh, even though I'm probably never gonna, well, I might use this character in the future, uh, just because they are a fest character, you know, like by virtue of being a fest character, they're like better than like half my roster. Oh no, we pulled two, oh, oh my goodness. That's one of the worst things about, oh, okay, well finally. All right, so how much do we fucking have? 
Okay, unfortunately, as much as I don't want to do this, uh, we do not have a copy of this guy's card at all. Or here, let me take a look and see. Because unfortunately, in order, to get, in order to make the card, we have to craft using the character soul. But by doing that, we, by virtue, fucking lose all 150 soul, which makes means I have to farm him significantly more. Let me just make sure I don't have his card before I do this. Yeah, I don't have a card. All right, because uh, I'm gonna forget about. I'm gonna forget to do this later, so I'm just gonna take care of this right now before things get too crazy. Oh, that fucking hurts! Oh, that hurts. That's a hundred and fucking fifty. Unfortunately, it's the character special ability, so like I have no real choice there. All right. Well, with that said, that's enough of uh, 